Hi, I'm Jeff Walker, the Director of Consumer Marketing at Enrix. We're here today at the Enrix Traffic Operations Center at our worldwide headquarters in Kirkland, Washington, where we get billions of points of data every month to give you the best real-time traffic information you can get on any device. And especially today, we want to talk about the fact that we're now on the Windows 8 platform. So what we have here is a Samsung Slate PC. It's a Windows Developer Preview PC, and it does a great job of showing what uh, the Windows 8 platform is all about. And what we're going to do here is bring up the Enrix traffic application. And because Windows 8 platform really emphasizes content over Chrome, um, it really gives us the opportunity to take advantage of the full screen experience. And, and this particular platform and the app are optimized for small and large screens alike. So what we're going to do right now is we're going to take a look at uh, traffic in the Bay Area. You might have seen when we first started the application, it really centered on where we are geographically, which is the Seattle area. But let's go ahead and take a look at the Bay Area since, uh, since there's a lot of activity going on there right now. We have data and traffic information on highways, freeways, arterials, and secondary roads. And we get more traffic information than any other company out there so that we can provide you with the best experience possible. Looks like there's an incident somewhere near the Golden Gate Bridge. Let's take a look at that. And that's uh, indicated here by this icon. And what we've got here is a ramp closed uh, at the Park Presidio uh, northbound at the US 101. Again, great information if you're heading in that direction or thinking about heading in that direction, you have something to work with. For the incidents down in the right corner, we can actually uh, filter those incidents out. So if I don't want to see congestion, for example, I just click on that congestion button back on the map. And you can see that those are taken off so that we can take advantage again of that real estate and just see what we want to see. The other thing you might have seen when we pulled that up is the, the thumbnails at the top. And these are called our forecast slider thumbnails. And really what this is is the ability to look into the future with respect to what traffic should be like in the area. So as we pull these thumbnails out, you'll see that in 15 minute increments, we can take a look at what Enrix traffic is going to be like in those areas. So we started uh, around 4 o'clock or so, and now we're looking a little bit later. And you can see, if you look at those thumbnails closely, that they're going to change in color in various areas. Let's get closer to 7 o'clock, where you'll see that traffic really starts to clear up. 6.45, 7 o'clock, and you'll see that there's very little red and yellow and orange and a lot more green. And so that's really telling you that there's a lot uh, of clearing up going on um, as you look at the map. So now you've seen an early look at the Enrix traffic application on the Windows 8 platform. And now you can get it for free on the Windows Store for Windows 8, or you can check us out at enrixtraffic.com.